Hi everyone, welcome to Concept in Medicine. In this tutorial, we are going to be looking at the point of auscultation of the heart. Let's start. So for the point of auscultation of the heart, we are going to be looking at the five points. But out of these five, four are very, very important with an additional one making it five. So as diagrammatized in this figure, we have the sternum. The sternum is made up of the manubrium, the body of the sternum, and the xiphi sternum. And at the junction between the manubrium and the body of the sternum lies what we call the sternal angle, or the angle of Louis, or manubriosternal junction. And the manubriosternal junction, or the angle of Louis, or the sternal angle, corresponds to the second rib and laterally extends into the second intercostal space, meaning that to listen for the heart sound, you will need to find the point. How do you find the point? You have to palpate the sternal angle, which is felt as a transverse prominence at the junction of the manubrium and the body of the sternum. If you look at this, the second intercostal space is closer to the angle of Louis. So once you palpate the angle of Louis, you move laterally, you are going to enter into the second intercostal space. And at the edge of the sternum, we have the border or the edge. So the first auscultation point, as labeled here, we will call it the aortic area. The second, pulmonary or pulmonic area. The third, the mitral area. The fourth, the triscopic area. And the fifth, the EPS point, which is an additional point. Not necessarily you have to auscultate in that anatomical landmark. So those are the points of auscultation. Now let's describe the points. The first point we said, the aortic area. Where do you find it? The aortic area, you will find it in the second intercostal space, right sternal border. If you don't like the right sternal border, you can also say right sternal edge. The pulmonic or the pulmonary area will be found in the second intercostal space. That is opposite to the aortic area. That is the second intercostal space, left sternal border. Then the third one, which we label as the mitral area, is found in the feet intercostal space, left mid clavicular line, also known as the cardiac apex, because that is where the apex bit is felt or palpated in a normal woman being, in the feet intercostal space, left mid clavicular line. The fourth one is the triscopic area, which can be auscultated in the fourth intercostal space, left sternal border or left sternal edge. And the additional point, which is the fifth one, the X point is, is auscultated in the third intercostal space, left sternal border. I hope it makes a good sense to you. Kindly make sure to subscribe, share, like, and comment which concepts you would like to see in my next video. Bye-bye.